Hey, what's up, IG Garage fam? Imagine this, you're driving along, everything seems fine, but suddenly that dreaded check engine light flicks on. You grab your scanner, and boom, P0046. This code can feel like a mystery, but it can seriously affect your turbocharged engine's performance. Don't worry, I've got your back. We'll break down what this code means and how you can fix it. Stick with me, and let's save your engine some stress. What does P0046 mean? P0046 refers to Turbocharger Supercharger Boost Control, a circuit range performance. This means there's an issue with the actuator controlling the turbo boost. If your turbocharger isn't functioning properly, your engine won't manage air intake efficiently, causing a noticeable drop in performance. Let's find the actuator and sensors causing the issue. The turbo boost control solenoid adjusts the turbocharger's pressure. It's typically located near the turbocharger connected via vacuum hoses and wiring to the car's ECU. Check the turbo boost pressure sensor near the intake manifold. It monitors boost and sends signals to the ECU. Malfunctioning components or damaged wiring cause the P0046 code. Now, let's talk symptoms. With a P0046 code, you'll notice sluggish acceleration, rough idling, or poor fuel economy. Your turbocharger isn't functioning right, losing power for a smooth drive. Ignoring these signs leads to bigger, costly problems. First things first, inspect the wiring to the boost control solenoid and the turbo boost pressure sensor. Look for any damage, loose connections, or corrosion. Clean and secure these connections. If the problem persists, replace the solenoid or sensor. Clear the code with your OBD2 scanner, then take your car for a test drive. If the check engine light stays off, you've done it right. And that's how you tackle a P0046 code. Remember, taking care of this problem early can prevent more expensive issues down the line. If this video helped you out, smash that like button, and don't forget to subscribe to IG Garage. And before you go, check out these other videos to keep learning. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.